Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be taking a look at the latest Gwent expansion, Curse of the Black Sun, which brought with it um, obviously a lot of new cards and that is going to be some of which, well at least one from each faction, going to be a scenario which is definitely going to shake things up quite a bit and Renfri, which is I must say really really crazy card. You can see it on screen right now. Um, she has some wacky wacky abilities which I'm didn't really get too much time to sink my teeth into today, but I'm definitely going to be trying out a lot of Renfrey decks tomorrow. Um, right now, don't mind the background, very dark. Power is currently out. Um, but yeah, the servers are also down right now, so not the most amazing circumstance to be in, but still got some gameplay from today. I um, tried a couple of decks on stream, so I thought I'd share you guys some gameplay from today's stream and um, show you a couple of decks that we tried out. And of course, tomorrow we'll be trying out a whole bunch more. So without further ado, let's get into the gameplay and you guys can check some of the new cards and decks in action. Deathwish. Is that Deathwish I see? Or am I just queuing to Ronin wholesomely playing V day one of a patch? <laughs> day one of expansion, let's play V. The Ronin way. Um, I should start with this. Actually, no, I should start with this. Yeah, I should start with this. Lamp, yeah, I keep forgetting. Deathwish Rainfree? Uh, the problem is you play Rainfree Deathwish, you can't play Haunt, and I'm pretty sure you want to play Haunt in the Deathwish deck. Alright, so I'll do that, then I'll probably honestly play, I think, the Chameleon next start game. Uh, okay, it, it is, it is Rainfree. Never mind. Forget what I said. Forget what I said. Okay, so the longer this round goes, the more care I get on this because I'm just gonna give me the triggers. Am I better off in the long run? I feel like I should be better off in the long run. And... Zamus Saxies with a prime reset for two months. Thanks so much. Appreciate it. And also, um, welcome back. So, we go long run, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I guess we do want to play like one card here just to trigger th um Honestly, I'm just gonna play this just so I can trigger my um, it's every every time I play a card it triggers this which is actually carry over So I might actually play another card as well. I might go like a Nero for Bengal Just to trigger my Just to trigger my um carry over for this score would be quite bad but I want my carry over okay so they pass here and then we got long round how is double scenario possible well, it's not possible in this deck, because it's a rain-free deck, but it is definitely possible. Generally speaking, at least. Purcell would be nice, but honestly, I think this hand is fine. Um, we have our poison, which is nice. We have all the important stuff. It's fine.
No gnome? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we have a gnome here. <laughs> Honestly? Very good heat wave. Okay. Got a scenario in a rain free deck? I don't think so. I don't think so. Oh, that's actually so good. What the hell? Oh, come on. Really? It's like one of the only good options you'll ever get from this. <sighs> Whatever. Did I play the Witcher games? And if so, do I like them? I played number three, and yes, I did like it very much. Okay. What am I going to poison? Show me what flows in your veins. Poison the second maximize harmony value. Your next move shall be your last. Can't use that. This I could use with Barnabas, I guess. Yeah, I can actually use it in mind. It can be used immediately. That's pretty cool, actually. How's consistency this deck? I mean, you have a Neuromancy, so... I guess it's... Okay. Ish. Probably get the Comedian down soon. Where's rain feed? Ah! I should put, uh, well, if I put things in the meta, I get more damage from Wake Cat, I guess. Yeah, it's Batiste. Go ahead, feel it. Okay, what leader ability are we getting? Do the different leader abilities have different icons, or are they all the same icon? No stacker. If I stack her up, I play more with the Wake Cat. That's the problem. Wake Cat. Same icon? Oh, okay. What did he get? Damage all? Oh shit. Fuck. That's such a good one to get. Oh lord. Oh god. Holy shit, that's the best one.
Uh... Yikes. Oh, this is gonna be a lot of points, chat. Ow, oh, holy fuck, Renfi's broken. Dude, Renfi is so broken. Like, this game is close. Only because of Renfi. Jeez. That ability is so nuts. Just that still would have won. That's not very good news, Hedek. Why are you playing this need ability? Why are you not playing pirates? Okay, what I want a mulligan here. Probably this. Probably this. Eh, maybe one of these actually. <laughs> Alright, so in this matchup, I don't really think there is going to be much poison value to be made, so I'm just going to poison that. Um. Yeah. Renfi Fleury? Could be. And Cyber with a primary sub for 11 months. Thanks, Cyber. Appreciate it. Welcome back for 11 months. Welcome back. Okay, so I'm going to poison that with Weeping Willow. I kind of want to get the chameleon down early because it's carryover. I don't need to get it down that early, but I want to get it down somewhat early. Because the earlier I get it, the more procs I'm going to get on this. You can kiss my tail goodbye. I think I'll play this though. And then I'll play Chameleon. Probably. Oh, how wonderful. You speak your tongue. So that's going to make this a lot better. <clears throat> okay, just passes. Um, dragon tag. So that. Come on! Holy shit, dude. Well, I guess we're going long run. <laughs> Actual Snickers. Alright, so that got a lot of tags for this at least. Actual gnome. Right time? Yeah, this doggo always trolls. <laughs> this doggo is the biggest troll ever. I need to draw waters, I need to draw my Neuromancy. Can I draw my Neuromancy for once? Because this is actually annoying. Wait, why am I never drawing my Neuromancy? A Neuromancy? One check. Hello? A Neuromancy? Oak? Barnabas? What else can you click on this board besides this portal? Where's the metal? Oh, this ring. So Naro token premium? Yes, but there's no audio. Sag. Okay. Give me good cards. Yes, that's a good card. Nice. That's also actually, this actually is a pretty good card. I actually like this card. Um, so I don't think I want this. I don't think I want that. Um, probably going to pull out Oak with the Neuromancy. Deckless? I mean, I'm still, this, I might need to optimize this a lot more to be fair. Um... Okay, so we find have access to Oak, which is nice. This is going to be a big finisher because we actually got a lot of value from Communion Run 1. Um, 
Probably gonna just start off with the scenario again. Card quote? I didn't give a card quote long ago, I think. Um. See, now this trade is so weak for him. Although it does trade and it probably is still worth it for him to do, it's. You've had your quote for a long time now. But thanks so much um, with the primary stuff for four months. Appreciate it. Um, That is still a good trade for me. I just trade up to eight to the heat wave, which is not bad. Um, I guess I'm just going to play this now. And then I think I want to put units on the board ASAP to make it harder for his lead ability to kill, kill things. <laughs> lead it? No, why would I have leaded that last turn? Now I lead it. What tag has this got? Beast. So that actually makes Hulk redundant, unless Hulk dies, of course. Muzzlol. Muzzloller? I guess I'll get the comedian down next. We shall do it my way. Compass deck? Probably. He kills the beast is gonna re-enable harmony again on the beast tag. Okay, that's fine. Guess I'll first get the communion down. Okay. Oh, it's a machine. Okay. Dwarf. I mean, Tito is going to be kind of bad in this matchup, but whatever. Looks like, um, so we have a dwarf, we have, a, we have all three tags of Barnabas, which is good. Hey, listen here. Listen well. Okay. So his last two cards are Compass into like a Morkvog, which is actually a shit ton of points. And then something else. Okay. Last card, more fog. No okay. Uh, most BM way. Yeah. Hoping you'd have a two. Patch and live for you? Should be. Death wish? Is that death wish I see? Or am I just queuing to Rogan wholesomely playing V day one of a patch? <laughs> day one of expansion? Let's play V. The Ronian way. <laughs> I 
Um, I guess I'll start with this. Actually, no, I should start with this. Yeah, I should start with this. Lamp, yeah, I keep forgetting. Deathwish, Rainfree? Uh, the problem is you play Rainfree, Deathwish, you can't play Haunt, and I'm pretty sure you want to play Haunt in the Deathwish deck. Alright, so I'll do that, then I'll probably honestly play, I think, the Camellia next start get uh, Okay, it, it is, it is Rainfree. Never mind. Forget what I said. Forget what I said. So the longer this round goes, the more care I get on this because I'm just going to come in with triggers. Am I better off in a long run? I feel like I should be better off in a long run. And... Zamus Saxies with a prime reset for two months. Thanks so much. Appreciate it. And also, um, welcome back. So, we go long run, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I guess we do want to play like one card here just to trigger th um Honestly, I'm just gonna play this just so I can trigger my um, it's every every time I play a card it triggers this which is actually carry over So I might actually play another card as well I Might go like a Nero for Bangle Just to trigger my Just to trigger my um carry over for this Okay, score would be quite bad, but I want my carry over. Okay. So you pass here, and then we got long round. How is double snare possible? Well, it's not possible in this deck. It's a rain-free deck, but it is definitely possible. Generally speaking, at least. Personal would be nice, but honestly, I think this hand is fine. Um, we have our poison, which is nice. We have all the important stuff. It's fine. No gnome? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we have a gnome here. <laughs> Honestly? Very good heat wave. Okay. Got a scenario in a rainfree deck? I don't think so. I don't think so. Oh, that's actually so good. What the hell? Oh, come on. Really? It's like one of the only good options you'll ever get from this. <sighs> Whatever. Did I play the Witcher games? And if so, did I like them? I played number three, and yes, I did like it very much. Okay. 
What am I gonna poison? Show me what flows in your veins. Just gonna poison the second maximize harmony value. Your next move shall be your last. Can't use that. This I could use with Barnabas, I guess. Then I can actually use it in mind. It can be used immediately. That's pretty cool, actually. How is consistency this deck? I mean, you have a Neuromancy, so. I guess it's. Okay. Ish. Probably get the comedian down soon. That's gonna hurt. Where's Rainfee? Ah! I should put, uh, well, I'll put things in the mailer, I get more damage from Wake Cat, I guess. Yeah, it's Batiste. Go ahead, feel it. Okay, what leader ability are we getting? Do the different leader abilities have different icons, or are they, they're all the same icon? No stacker, if I stack her up, I play more with the Wake Cat. That's the problem, Wake Cat. Same icon? Oh, okay. What did he get? Damage all? Oh shit. Fuck. That's such a good one to get. Oh lord. Oh god. Holy shit, that's the best one. Uh Yikes. Oh, this is gonna be a lot of points, chat. Ow, oh, holy fuck, Renfi's broken. Dude. Renfi is so broken. Like, this game is close. Only because of Renfi. Jeez. That ability is so nuts. Just damaging everything by multiple times, which can be pretty good. So. I don't know. Even, even though getting him multiple times can be kind of awkward, it's usually still good enough. Okay, now that we can play a non mirror, hopefully. What do I want to mulligan here? This, this. Um, I don't have anything to discard. Both of these. Probably gonna mulligan away one of them, I guess. Then. All right. Start with this, I guess. Did 
need it now, really. Why is everyone so obsessed with winning on even? I mean, shit, whatever. Wrong boat. That was not the boat I wanted. Um, shit. I can do a great deal oh my god, what is up with everyone trying to be? We're not even friends. Bounce him, but I don't think I need to bounce him. I mean, I could bounce and preserve the veteran for later. Get rid of the boat, and then he can come back and we can do this again later. Oh, it's a rain free deck. Yeah, sure, whatever. Oh my god. <sighs> this is annoying. I was getting coin flip abuse so hard by this. It's actually very, very annoying. Rain free decks seem very annoying if you get red coin. They're just like omega coin flip abuse decks. You get red coin and then the. We don't even could just slam your leader ability for no reason. Kind of annoying. Two pirates in hand. But I guess it's time to play Krach. We follow Letho. Actually, try and tilt me. No rat will escape my right, um, the wind is all we've left of the god. I could potentially return it back to hand. <laughs> and discard this, I guess. Hey, Alright, let's see what he gets. Yeah. Ten or less power it means Krach dies. Actually, it's not even that bad. Krach doesn't have many pirates in it anyway. Whatever. What's the passive though? Cooldown 7. It's a bit late for the cooldown 7, isn't it? Oh, I killed the Bjorn, actually. Interesting. Interesting. 
interesting. Hey, listen here. Listen well. Let's not get in the way of me, Okay. My compass because I'm gonna over thin then. Well, actually, I'm gonna take out three or put it back. Well, I guess I could, but yeah, I guess I actually could have picked up this one extra because it's echo card, so it goes back. Yeah, I guess I could have put compass there. Sure. I mean, I don't think the boats can be that much value anymore because of the fact that he's not gonna be playing many tall units, so it's whatever. I'd rather have the other thing here. Subtract points, level leader ability. I have a lot of reactivity in hand, I need some proactivity. Don't you pester me. Right, and eat me girly. Look at him. What's the chapter one again? Every time something dies, spawn a cataclysm, right? This guy's gonna bathe in the fires of hell. Have fun with it. You can kiss my tail goodbye. Did you die already? Or need I kill you again? Right, what's the perspective characters I'm spawning here? Well, I'm supposed to get cataclysm. Wait, what? Eh? Yeah. Wait, what? What? What infuse does that thing have then? I'm confused. Whatever. Um. What's the best card to pull here? Probably still for Kusi, isn't it? Artis? What does Artis do? Play a 4 version cultist from your deck? I don't have any cultists in my deck. It's probably just for Kusi. Can be? Doesn't work now. Chat, stop trying to bait me into doing stupid things. Yeah, just for Kusia. Sacrifices must be made on both sides. Uh, I suppose. <laughs> nice board you got there, Mr. Opponent.
this res. Hidden cash. Now the problem with this scenario is a greediest one, so this one I actually need to win one to bleed it because this scenario completely outgrades my one. And these cards, I'm still not sure how the hell he's supposed to play these things. Have I tried any, any other deck? Nope, I've only played Thrive for the last five hours. Smile. Of course I've played other decks. Card Shin says scratch has a lot of points. Yep. How do I get to round three with all my cards? Teach me the ways of going to round three without spending anything. Ultimate. I mean, Ultimate actually played for a lot of points last game. Okay, that's weird to see Syndicate. I'll just drown it. And then I suppose I will play. I don't know. I don't know what I'll play next. We'll see. Except sometime they're quite fresh. I could play this and put Thrive on things, but. Whatever. Playing this. And possibly play one of these. Man's got the wares <laughs> if you've got the coin. So Neko Warrior plays quite a bit of value here. And Goliath also plays for quite a bit too. So scratch shot is a lot of points, but I don't know. It's the problem with this deck is you need to try to keep everything for round three, and it's kind of vulnerable to lose it. If you lose round one, I don't know what you're supposed to do. Maybe for that reason, you're supposed to actually play. Ah, maybe you're supposed to play like a relics thrive hybrid. Stronger round one. How about this one? Okay. Play fruit tricks. So I was thinking of now. Thanks for the 25 bit share. Um, X Maple, appreciate it. Oh, sorry, M M Maple rather, should I say. Could pass, I can go two down, but I think I want to win on even. Plant basically got plus two here and plus two here. So I played as a seven. Ah, it's so bad though. Conditional seven. Very conditional. Very, very conditional. That's not really a hand that bleed. I mean, I suppose I could bleed with. F I mean, I don't want to bleed with. 
I'm worried that his scenario is going to just outpoint you. But then again, this scratch lot is also a shit ton of value in the long run through. Especially if Koshi, if I can draw that as well. Passing here is a bit sketchy because I know his scenario can be a lot of points. I mean, why did I break Gwent? I don't know nothing. I don't know why the servers are broken. At least the servers are fine for me. For once, it's not me though. It's getting locked out. Koshi, good. Now give me... Ooh, nice. Okay. Oswald would also be kind of nice. Okay, there we go. We have our stuff. So how do we do this? Do we start with Defender? Shimuro94 just subscribed. I can't play new expansion, so I'll gonna watch Laughing Face. Okay, yeah. I don't know why the servers are broken. Well, thanks so much, um, Samar... Sij... Ah. Pronunciation! This is so weird. S followed by a Z. How does one pronounce? Yeah, okay. I'm actually quite scared about this. I shouldn't play this first. That could be kind of scary. But thanks so much. I really appreciate it. Um, that could be a bit of a concern because the doctresses are gonna get a hold of the fuck. So Scratch Doll is gonna get... Oh god. Oh boy, I am scared. This. Oh boy. Um... Defenders actually making things. I actually need to cut the defender, I think. It's making things awkward now because I really want to get my engines to. Oh my god. Control the docks. Control the city. Oh god. I wish I'd known it was this. I would have absolutely bled round two then. Quick, move those moves. Can this kill anything? Jeez. Oh. All right, the trigger thrive, that's why. Oh my god, there's so many points. This is so greedy. I don't know how you can f try and make it to round three holding all this shit. 
That's so greedy. My god. I think I'm still gonna win though. points um huh, we actually beat this by a lot <laughs> anyway that is gonna be the, the the video hope you guys enjoyed it um like i said new expansion that did come out a lot of new stuff to try it and i'm gonna be trying out a whole bunch of new things over the next coming days so expect a lot of videos covering the latest decks from this upcoming well not upcoming but rather the current expansion which um obviously going to be quite interesting to see how these new archetypes or Rather, should I say, returning archetypes in a lot of cases um, are going to be shaping up in the current meta. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys again on the next one. Take care and bye-bye.